Yeah, okay, I'm here at at 4418. The door is totally locked. It, there, there's no studio here. It's like a it's like a dark alley with trees and I, 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 I'm I, I'm out of here. I, I can't I can't I'm not sure that I can peanut M M's. Yeah, I'm gonna stay for just a couple minutes. Yeah. Tonight's guest is Brian Baumgartner. Happy to be here too. I may never let you leave. I'm gonna fucking leave <laughs> as soon as I can. <laughs> That's it. I kind of can't believe that I just sang with you. I think it's the bed. Really? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I think it's the bed. Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever done an interview in bed before? Not that was filmed. Okay. How about I um, offer you... A peanut M&M, Pe which is your favorite? Peanut M&M's. I love peanut M&M's. Cheers. Cheers. And guess what else I have for you? Yeah? Your other favorite midnight snack, which I have a feeling this might be your first favorite. Really? Crown and Coke. How did you know? I just know things. Do you? Yeah, I like this. And mm. your publicist told me. Really? Yep. <laughs> She's good that yeah, way. Yeah, she is. Mm. Did I make it too stiff? Give me a drink. You can never make it too stiff. Right? Are you weird about sharing? What? It's too late. No. Perfect. Oh! Wow, that is good. Yes. Woo! Looked like you liked it. All right, let's get to my favorite part of the interview. Since we're okay. in bed, it's kind of cozy. It's girl talk. It's oh. slumber party talk. Real? Okay. Mm -hmm. First kiss. Tell me about it. My first kiss was in seventh grade. Okay. That might be, is that old? Is that young? Is that normal? I think normal, although I'm kind of a slut, so I don't know. Really? <laughs> First set of boobies you ever saw. Were they nice? Really, really nice. They were? Oh, yeah. How old were you? Uh, 24. 24. Oh, you waited a long time between kissing no, and boobies. I Did you know what to do with boobies? When I first saw them? Yeah. I'm sure. It's like instinctual, isn't it? I don't know. No, I think so. Did you know what to do with them? <laughs> Your first set? <laughs> Did you? I don't, I don't remember when someone touched my boobies for the first time. Because you were blacked out? <laughs> Did you ever poop your pants in your adult life? In my adult life? Mm -hmm. Oh, come on. Like, you have to think about if you pooped your pants? No, I didn't ever poop my pants. I'm trying to think of some story to give you about <laughs> pooping pants, but... You never were stuck on the freeway. Like, for example, the 110, and you couldn't get off the freeway, and you were like, oh, my God, I have to poop, and then you kind of let it go, and then you pooped your pants? You never did that? That story right there sounds ominously, <laughs> like, personal. Right? That's it? No, just an example, because I didn't want you to feel uncomfortable. Sometimes there's emergencies. Well, you got to pull over and... No, no, I don't... What is... No. I just assume everyone's pooped their pants. Really? Yeah. I honestly can't remember. So fine, you're better than me. Whatever. Now it's time for fan mail. <laughs> fan mail? Oh, what is that? This yeah. is actually from one of our uh, fans... On Twitter, what it would sound and look like if Kevin had an orgasm. This is not Nikki underscore Boyer. Nope, no, it's is... not me. If Kevin got lucky enough to get laid. Right, which he his... does, by the way. Okay. Why do we have to like act like he doesn't? Oh, okay. Well, just going with probably what America thinks. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> what it would look like and sound like if he had an orgasm. Oh... Yeah. <laughs> you guys are selling. Next man, next man, next man. 